Hi, good evening, everyone. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? How are you tonight? Good evening. Good evening. Everybody good on this Thursday? Very good, teacher. Very good. The last one. I'm good. good. To finish, to finish the model. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Very quickly. <laughs> Welcome, Marielos, Edith. Juan Antonio, Veronica Alegría, Christian, who else we have? Jonathan, Jessica Franco, Jessica Esmeralda, Luz Garcia. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome everyone to your class. Are you ready to go on, to continue? Okay. Yes, yes. ready. Yes, ready as always. That's good. Isn't it raining? In your area? No está lloviendo por ahí? No. No, it's not raining. Here, near my house, yes, it's raining a lot. <laughs> Anoche a tiempo uh -huh. terminamos la clase porque yes. inmediatamente se terminó y empezó a llover y hasta se, se, casi se va la luz y todo. Yes. Ante noche the igual. If the energy goes out, there is a problem. <laughs> yes, that's a big problem. All right, we'll continue then here to finish our with our session today. We are going to like continue with this one with the abilities, abilities and talents. We're going to watch a video about it. Other, technical or mechanical. Uh, just like you share your work in our discussion. Hi everyone, in this class you'll learn vocabulary for discussing different abilities and talents. Let's get started by listening to some common abilities and talents. Word power. Musical or artistic. Paint pictures. Play the violin. Sing English songs. Technical or mechanical. Design a web page. Fix a car. Fix a motorcycle. Athletic. Do gymnastics. Ride a horse. Surf. Other. Bake a cake. Play chess. Tell good jokes. Now I would like for you to do a couple of things. First, categorize these activities using the categories musical or artistic athletic, other, technical or mechanical. Uh, just like you see on the example, other, bake a cake. Then I would like for you to use the vocabulary and relate it to yourself, a family member or a friend. For example, I can fix a car, but I can't fix a motorcycle. After you finish this activity, share your work in our discussion forums. Okay, so let's go ahead. Uh, in the video, it's not like very easy to see clear, right? But here we have them clear. Now we can read them. As it's saying here that we need to complete the warm up. Complete the warm up with abilities and talents from the list. Then list and check. So we're going to do, like I say, by categories. We have musical or artistic, athletic, technical or mechanical, or we have other, right? Other types. So let's check that bake a cake is in other, right? Cannot be music or artistic or technical, mechanical or athletic. What about design a web page? What category is it? No, there. Design a web page. It has to do with computer, right? Yes. Uh huh. So it can be technical. Technical. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Correct. Can be technical. Ya no me fijo que está. So it can be design a website. 
a website. A website. What about do gymnastics? Ivis, welcome, Ivis. Um, teacher, um, in context, perdón, que voy entrando. Oh, okay. We are going to hear, say, in the different categories of the abilities uh -huh. and talents. For example, uh -huh. here in lo, other, lo we have bake a cake. Contrario. Lo contrario. Not the contrary, but you are going to make different selections. For example, uh -huh. if you say design a web page, is in the category of technical. Uh, because uh, it has to do with computers. So it's technical. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Do gymnastics. Uh -huh. What can it be? Is it musical or artistic? Is it technical uh -huh. or mechanic or athletic? Athletic. It's athletic, right? Because it has to do with uh -huh. athlete. It has to do with exercise. So it needs to uh -huh. be this category. Uh -huh. Do gymnastics. Uh -huh. The gymnastics. That's right. Very good. Fatima Araujo. Fix a car. What category is it? What? Aha. Uh -huh. In this case, it will be mechanical, right? Mechanical, right? That will be fix a car because when you repair a car, that you take it to the mechanic. So that's fix a car. Nice one. Christian, the next one. Fix a motorcycle. Technical. Mm -hmm. Or mechanical, right? Yes. Uh huh. That's good. So that would be fix a motorcycle. The surf. Uh huh. Do uh, athlete, athletic. It's athletic, right? Because it has to do with the athlete sports that they have. So that will be sore. Mm -hmm. Marielos, what about paint pictures? Artistic. Artistic, exactly. That will be paint pictures. Excellent. What about play chess? Edith? Perdón, sería musical. Let me see. Play chess. No. Remember Play what chess. is chess? Chess no. is a, is no, a no, game. No, no, no. ¿Qué es? Chess is a game. It's like a, ajedrez. Okay. It's, entonces, a, it's a game. No. Uh -huh. Athletic. Athletic? No, because you don't do exercise. Okay. It's a game. Esto es ajedrez. Ajedrez, exactly. Ah, entonces sería eh, other. It's other exactly because it's not technical or mechanical. Mm. Uh, it either musical or artistic. artistic. No, but it's no, other. It's That's great. Play chess. Ajedrez dice, ¿verdad? Exactly. Play chess. Let's see about the next one. Play the violin. M musical or artistic. Uh -huh. Musical. It's musical, right? Uh huh. That's good. So that would be play the violin. Excellent. That's right. Rene, ride a horse. What ability or talent can this be? Ride a horse. Play. I'm sorry? Riding a horse. Sing English song. Todo, right. todo esas right. son, son they talents. Are talents and abilities. So we need to put in different categories. Oh. Pitch a car. ¿Qué significa pitch a car? Fix, repair, repair a car. Fix is repair. Uh, mm -hmm. Ride a horse. Ride a horse. What is ride? Mm -hmm. Montar. Montar un caballo. Excellent. Montar. So what is the category? What is the category here? Is musical or artistic? Is athletic, other, or technical or mechanical? Athletic, other, technical, um, athletic. Athletic, right? Because these persons, they have to do exercise to have the ability. So let's write it here. That will be ride a horse. Ride a 
horns. A horse, that's right. Let's go on our next one. Sing English songs. Miguel Antonio? Miguel, are you there? Joaquin? Joaquin, are you present? No. Veronica Alegría? Present. Teacher. Hello. Veronica Cecilia y, y, y Catherine Rebecca dicen que estarán de oyentes porque. They, do, they have problems. Catherine tiene right. mala señal. Mm -hmm. Okay. Y, okay. Uh, they have problems. Thank you. Thank you so much. So, Veronica? Veronica Alegría? Presente, teacher. Hello. What will be the category of? Sing English Musical. songs. Musical. Right. Mm -hmm. or... Exactly. That will be sing English songs. Thank you. Okay. We have already Sorf here that is athletic. Tell good jokes. Veronica Cepeda? Tell good jokes. Oh, I'm sorry. She is listening right now. Ibis? What category is it? Tell good jokes. What are jokes? Uh, será other? Other? Yeah, that's good. Yes. Tell good jokes. What are jokes? Uh, what, uh, what is Chistes. jokes? ¿Qué Chistes. quiere decir? What does it mean? Jokes. Chistes. ¿Cómo? Chistes. Chistes. Ah. Correct. Contar Decir buenos, buenos chistes. chistes. Contar buenos Ajá, chistes. Correct. So it, this is ability, right? Sí. This is an ability, yes. So that's mm -hmm. tell good jokes. All right. Good one. Now give me more examples here about this structure. I can fix a car, but I can't fix a motorcycle. Gabriela, Abigail. Yes. Yes. Can you give me an example, please? You say, I can fix a car, but I can't fix a motorcycle. You can select other, other abilities here, different abilities that you can do and you can't do. Uh, I can... I can. Se puede decir montar en motocicleta. Right, ajá. Uh -huh. I can ride a motorcycle. I can a mo ride. Uh, ride, ride a motorcycle. Ajá. Uh -huh. But. But. I can bicycle. But I can't ride. But I can't ride a bicycle. A bicycle. Very good job. That's nice. Thanks. Okay. Yeah. Edit. I'm oh, sorry. Mm -hmm. Yo diré otro ejemplo. Okay. De... Very good. Thank you. Hmm. All right. Edit. Continue, please. Hi. Yeah. I, sería, yes. um, I can't. I can sing Spanish songs. Ah, okay. I can sing <laughs> Spanish songs, but... But I can't mm -hmm. uh, play football. Play football. Very good job. Nice. Thank <laughs> you. Great. Ibis, go on. Este, okay. Sería, I can paint pictures, but I can uh, surf. But I can't, I can't surf. surf. That's right. Really good. Nice. Marielos. Okay. I can ride a horse, mm -hmm. but I can't bake a cake. Excellent. That's right. Good job. Nice. Thank you. Okay. Let's see the next one. Christian. 
Okay. I can fix a car, but I can't tell jo good jokes. But I can't tell you good jokes. Very good. Excellent, guys. Really good. Okay, let's go on our next part. Let's erase these ones. And we'll go this by races, like they are also abilities. It says that by the end of this class, you will read and discuss an article about four unique American races. You will also develop skills in reading for a specific information. For example, this one. You can observe here that we have a horse racing. When they right? They run. The horses run, but a person is guiding. Or we also have dog racing. So, carreras, right? This, they are dog racing. So, these ones are taken in North America, but you know, uh, they also have races in different countries. So, let's have a video about it, and then we're going to read it. Hi everyone, in this class you'll read an article about four unique American races. You'll also develop skills in reading for specific information. Race the U.S. Climb the stairs of New York City's Empire State Building in the Empire State Building run-up. The climb is 1,050 feet, 320 meters, 86 floors, or 1,575 steps. Winners can reach the top in just 10 to 11 minutes. Can you? Take 8 or 10 days to race across America, from Irvine, California to Savannah, Georgia. Cross the entire U.S. in this 2,900-mile, 4,667-kilometer bicycle race. In this race, there are no timeouts for sleep. For 8 to 10 days, racers can sleep only about 3 hours each day. Race on the exciting white waters of the Arkansas River in the Downriver Race. Winners complete the 25.7 miles, 41.5 kilometers, in just 2 hours. This is the longest downriver race in the U.S. One person, one boat, take the challenge. Only possible in Alaska, the Iditarod Sled Dog Race. Race from downtown Anchorage to Nome, over 1,150 miles, 1,850 kilometers, through cold, wind, and snow. Winners usually finish the course in 9 to 12 days and receive cash prizes. All right, so let's have the reading here. This one's it about races, but in specifically the U.S. So let's see about the first one. Climb the stairs of New York City's Empire State Building in the Empire State Building run-up. So this is the name of the empire. The climb is 1,050 feet equals to 320 meters, 86 floors, or 1,575 steps. Winners can reach the top in just 10 to 11 minutes. Can you? Do you have new vocabulary here? Can reach, ¿qué quieres? Puede alcanzar, can reach. Puede alcanzar la cima, la cúspide, reach the top. So in just 10 to 11 minutes, so that's very fast. It's a long distance, but they do it because they practice a lot. 
Let's see on the next one. It says, race on the exciting white waters of the Arkansas River in the Down River Race. Winners yeah. completes the 25.7 miles, equals to 41.5 kilometers in just two hours. This is the longest Down River Race in the U.S. One person, one boat, take the challenge. New vocabulary. What is the meaning of challenge? Reto. So they say, this is a challenge. Es un reto. Teacher, ahí yes. para cuando dijo lo de 41.5, el punto se pronuncia así tal cual, como punto en inglés. Let me see which one. In this one, in Race on Exciting. Sí, 41. That means that is not like a 42. No son 42 kilómetros, sino 41.5 kilómetros. 41 kilómetros y medio. Ah, ah, por eso. Mm -hmm. Es que yo escuché que en la pronunciación usted dijo el número 41 y el punto, algo así como... Point. Pero en eso sí. Point. Así se dice tal cual. Pa exactly. Ajá, you say point. Ah, okay. 41.5. Okay. Thanks, teacher. You're welcome. It's the same here. It's 25.7. Eh, ¿Qué significa la palabra stairs? Stairs, gradas. Ah, está. Gradas. Gradas. Okay. Climb es brincar, ¿verdad? Climb, no, escalar uh -huh. o trepar. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Ok, gracias. You're welcome. Ok, let's continue with the next one. It says, only possible in Alaska, the editorial sled dog race. <laughs> So there are dogs that they run. Race from downtown Anchorage to Nome over 1,150 miles equals to 1,850 kilometers through cold, wind, and snow. Winners usually finish the course in 9 to 12 days and receive cash prizes. Question about that? New vocabulary? Receive. 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 Es el verbo recibir. Receive. Ellos reciben eh, dinero. Ajá. Okay. Ajá. Premios. Premios en efectivo. Oh, Prices. Ah, Prices son premios. En Price. cash, en efectivo. En efectivo. So cash money. Ajá. Ibis, yes, you have a question? Sí, ¿Qué significa? Idaitaro. Idaitaro Slid, Dog Race. This one is a name, es el nombre. Es el nombre uh -huh. que le asignan a ese tipo de carrera, que es carrera con perros. Disculpe que la moleste. No, tell me, tell me. Se escucha mucha interferencia. Quizás algunos compañeros tienen encendido su micrófono. Ajá, uh -huh. there is interruption. No se le escucha bien. Thank you, thank you. Help me with the... Thank you, thank you, Edith. Okay, thank you. Okay, any other vocabulary? No será maltrato animal ese teacher. It is, it is, all of this. Sí. De hecho lo es, it is. In many, it's like it. Racing horse? Yes, that's another one. Teacher. Mm -hmm. It's true. Arriba, en el inicio de la lectura dice Only possible in Alaska de, de lo demás, no sé qué dice. Y Ajá, y lo demás es LED. Ajá, correcto. Es LED is because they use this. Utilizan este tipo de, de transporte para eh, hacerlo en la carrera. Es como un tri, tipo trineo en el que va montada la persona. Eso significa... That's a sled. That's a sled. Ah, ¿Y la palabra anterior? Editor es el nombre que le asignan. Mm. Es un nombre que le asignan a ese tipo de, de carrera. But it's with oh. dogs. It's in the cold. Imagine it's in cold, wind, va en lo helado, el viento y la nieve. So definitivamente es maltrato. Es maltrato animal. Sí. Pobrecito, más la fuerza que van ejerciendo que van a... Ajá. 
Ya. Este, uno sí. se... Aunque ellos más... están acostumbrados, ¿verdad? Pero igual. Los... Ajá. A los ya. pobres animales. O no sé ¿Sí? también, un pequeño paréntesis que tal vez no entra en esa categoría, pero que lo hacen y es, creo que en España es que sueltan mm. un pobre toro ah, y ahí yes. andan viendo a toda la gente. Entonces es, que... es maltrato también. Esa es maltreatment. Ya deberían de prohibir eso, ¿verdad? No good for the animals. Let's go ahead with the next one. This is about bicycle race. He says, take eight or ten days to race across America from Irving, California to Savannah, Georgia. Cross the entire U.S. in this 2,900 mile equals to 4,667 kilometer bicycle race. In this race, there are no timeouts for sleep. For eight to ten days, racers can sleep only about three hours each day. So no time to relax, no time to rest. So they have to continue, right? Riding the bike for that time. New vocabulary there? A mí se me olvidó qué significaba la palabra sled del nombre de la carrera de perros. Sled. Sled es como un tipo trineo. Trineo. Ajá, en el que va la persona. Montada. Ah, ok, sí, sí, sí. Uh -huh. Es un trineo liviano, ¿verdad? Yeah, exactly. Ajá, uh -huh. so it's only for one person. Ajá, yo lo busqué y está así como que los diferentes tipos de trineo. Ajá, uh -huh. they have the different types. Yeah, because they, there are others that they are more persons. It's like in Santa Claus. <laughs> He has a sled. <laughs> they are like the deers, right? Son como los ciervos. They are like deers. So how do you call it? They are different types of uh -huh. these animals. <laughs> All right. Question about this? No vocabulary? Each, ¿qué significa? I'm sorry? Each day. Each day. Each, each day, that each. means, it's like every day. Cada día. Cada día. Ajá. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Gracias. So they only, it says, the racers can sleep only about three hours each day. Imagine to sleep only three hours. Ajá, uh -huh. por día. Not sufficient time to relax. Una pregunta, teacher, es que yes, cuando okay. se utiliza every y cuando se utiliza each. This one, por... you can substitute this one. Estas pueden ser sustituidas. Ambas significan cada. Bless you, Edith. <laughs> But normally when you use each, is for example, when you take um, medicine, como cuando uno toma medicina, it says that take a pill, Each five hours, for example, or each six hours, but also can be every. Se sustituyen. Ambas significan cada. Thank you, teacher. You're cada siete horas. Ajá, exactly. So ah, every bueno. day is each day. Yes. Mm -hmm. Any other question? Eh, otra, teacher, la palabra uh, prices uh, que me prices. dijo que se... Ajá, Premios. esa palabra... Premio. Y hay premium. otra palabra que también se escribe así, premium. No sé qué significa. Ah, but that's premium. Mismo. Esa es como la calidad. La calidad de algo. Es premium. Es mm. premium. Uh -huh. Pero es la calidad ah. de algo. Sí, entonces en este caso, solamente no, miren, allí solo lo que miren que animales tiene más, más este, salud, más fuerza, más ejercicio. Eso es todo, no es que midan calidad ni nada, ¿verdad? Es solamente the quality. la quality. La... Ajá, the resistency. Ah, ok. Es si hacen resistency. ejercicio, They can eso, resist esa, clase more. Perros, esa clase de perros son que si no le sacan a hacer ejercicio, eh, padecen uh -huh. de desplazamiento de cadera y, y yes. no duran mucho tiempo. Yes, because... Ellos son energéticos. Uh -huh. Ajá, y depende on the race, right? Todo depende de las razas. Ajá, uh -huh. sí. yeah, that's true. They suffer from the column, de la columna. So they, they Sacamos a Firulay y se muere. Yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> it, 
it dies. No, <laughs> <resistance>. se pasaron. <laughs> no much resistance. <laughs> Poor Pirulaya. <laughs> All right. Let's continue here then. We got another exercise. This one is according to this one, to the previous reading. Let's check. Read the article, then complete the chart. We're going to check about the places, distances, and winning times. Let's see about number one. Empire State Building run up. What is the place? New York. New York, New York City. A New York City, right? That's correct. Okay. New York City. A New York City. Let's check the other one. What about to race across... America. Uh, Arkansas. It's for Irving, California, Arkansas. Savannah, Irving, Georgia. Irving, California, right? To Savannah, Georgia. So it goes to all these places. So this one, correct. The other place, Down River Race. Down River Race. Alaska. Arkansas. Arkansas River. Which one? Arkansas, look. Arkansas River. Arkansas. Arkansas River. So we have Arkansas River. Right? Well, right. that's the place. Uh, yes. It's river. 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 What about okay. uh, Click it the, river? River. It's river. Editor sled dog rice. In Alaska. Yes. That's in only Alaska. in Alaska, exactly. It's only Alaska. right. Because it's possible for the snow that they can slide very well. Okay, we check the places. What about the distances? Distances of Empire State. Empire State. What's the distances? Uh, <laughs> 150 feet. 20.7 meters. This one? 1,000? 1,000 feet, 50, 15. Uh -huh. 50 feet. <laughs> that is equals to 320 mm. meters. 20 meters. 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 All right. 86 meters. meters. Yeah, correct. What about race across America? Race across America, <laughs> this one, right? <laughs> Race across America? 2,000. 2,000? 900 miles. 900 miles, correct. That is equals to? 4,667 6, kilometers. Kilometers, yes, that's correct. What's the next one? Down River Race. Down River Race. 25.7 miles. 25.7 miles. Good. In kilometers? 41.5 kilometers. Kilometers, that's right. And the last one, Editor Sled Dog Race. What's the distance? One thousand one hundred fifty miles. Mm -hmm. Good. Equals to kilometers. One thousand eight hundred eight hundred kilometers. Fifty kilometers. That's right. Good. Kilometers. Nice. Now in the next part, winning times. What will be the winning times of Empire State? You see, it says winners can, can reach the top in just 10 to 11 minutes. 10 to 11 minutes. Seven Hello? Nine, Hello? 20 days. Yes. Uh -huh. 10 to 11 minutes, 10 right? 10 to 11 minutes. Nice. That's good. Okay, let's check the next one. What about that river race? Two hours. Two hours. It takes uh -huh, two hours. Excellent. What about the irritator? The dog race? 
Okay. Nine, nine to, to twelve days. Nine to Sorry. twelve days. Why? There's a lot of days. And the last one, race across America. No time out. Three hours each day that they can sleep. Right? Three oh. hours each day. Each day. Each day. Okay, so they so have different times. Eight to ten yes. days. Mm -hmm. So they have for eight, eight to ten days, to ten days that it takes for right because. Uh, three hours each day is that they sleep. They can sleep in this time. Mm, yes. uh, Tell me. Eight uh, hours. So 10 days is the time that they take like to win. Ah, because but, three but... hours is to sleep. They have permission to sleep. Approximately for three hours. Mm -hmm. All right, we are going to pass the list. Let me know if you are present. Mm -hmm. Adalise. Uh, hello, teacher. Uh, hello, thank you, Ada. Ana Beatriz. Ada Beatriz. Angélica María. Angélica María. Carlos Arturo. Present. Thank you, Carlos. Christian Daniel. Present. Thank you, Christian. Edith Lorena. Present, teacher. Thank you, Edith. Fatima Yesenia. Present. Thank you, Fatima. Gabriela. Abigail. Thank you, Gabriela. Ibis. Ibis. Yes, you are there. Thank you. Jessica Franco. Present. Thank you, Jessica. Joaquín Jesús. Joaquín Jesús. Jonathan Adonai. Present teacher. Thank you, Jonathan. Juan Antonio. Present. Thank you. Catherine Rebecca. Present teacher. Thank you. Kevin Orlando. Kevin Orlando. Lenin Monterrosa. Dijo present en el chat. Thank you. Thank you very much. Liliana Patricia. Liliana Patricia. Luz Margel. Present. Thank you. María de Los Ángeles. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Mauricio Alberto. Mauricio Alberto. Miguel Antonio. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Olimpia Valeria. Olimpia Valeria. Oscar Esaú. Oscar Esaú. René Alfonso. René Alfonso. Present. René, remember, yes, very good. Roxana Guadalupe. Present. Thank you, Roxana. Verónica Cepeda. Present, teacher. Thank you. Verónica Maricela. Present, teacher. Thank you. Jensi. Jensi Alexandra. Jessica Esmeralda. Jessica Esmeralda. Present, Thank you, Jessica. And Jessica Rivas. <coughs> Jessica Rivas. No? Okay. Let's continue. Está lloviendo muy fuerte. No escucho nada. Hello, and now? 
Lenin is present. Okay. Teacher, buenas noches. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Joaquin. Este, cuando estaba, ah, you sí, didn't cuando estaba pasando el video, me, me sacó, ah, okay. sí. You had problems, right? Okay, let me check here. Let me verify the list. Gracias. Yeah. You're welcome. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Let me see. Yes, okay. Thank you so much. It's ready. Okay, as we have this one and that exercise. Now, look, we finished that module. Now we can have like a short review, a general review about what we studied these four weeks. Remember that in these four weeks, we also saw the five sessions. These five sessions, we got number one, my sister works downtown. In the ones that you studied about transportation, right? Like this, we also saw about all the means of transportation, like car, bikes, motorcycle, bus, taxi, right? In section number two, we studied about, does it have a view? And it had to do with house or apartment and all the furniture that we have in our houses. In section three, we studied about what do you do? It had to do with jobs, jobs and occupations. In the section four, we saw about broccoli is good for you. That had to do with food. So you talk about your favorite food. In the last section, that's section five, I can't ice skate very well. This one was about like the different sports and also the talents and abilities that we have. So let's go on here. We have here a small exercise. In the one, we can remember the simple present statements. We have the third person singular that remember what happens with the he, she, and it. You need to include the S to the verb. For example, take, takes. Walk, walks. Go, goes. Study. Teacher, teacher. Hello. Disculpe la interrupción. Se me desconectó la señora. Ah, ok. Sí, se le escucha cortada ahorita. ¿Usted escucha bien ahorita? Hello. Hello. Can everybody hear? ¿Se escucha? Sí, ya empezó a llover, teacher. Ajá, ya empezó, sí es cierto. Ajá. Entonces, se escucha a veces como, como cortado, interferencia. So, we are here, right? With dance, with the third person. If we have dance, dances. What? Hello. Okay, so we have watch. Watches. Irregular because they are different, right? Do, does, does. have, has. Does. We have this short exercise. We are going to complete it. Edit, can you start, please? You're going to read it. And you're going to include verbs if it's with base form or with the S form. My family. My family and I mm -hmm. live. 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 In the suburbs. In the suburbs, right? Uh huh. Continue. My wife. My wife and I. Uh huh. Um, I work. Work, work right? Base form. Because here work. you're including my wife and I is two persons. Base form. Work. Work near here. Near here. Thank you. That's good. Jessica Esmeralda. Are you there, Jessica? So we no. work. Yes. Yeah, my teacher. <coughs> Let's go ahead here, please. So we, and you need to select what form of the bird. Oh. Oh. 
So we uh -huh. walk. Car. Car. Walk. 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 Base form, right? Because it's plural. So we walk to or to go to work. To go. All right. Thank you. Mariello, or, continue, please. Or brother Emily. Right. Work. Our daughter. Our daughter Don't Emily. Home. I'm sorry, what is the option? Our daughter Emily? Emily works. Works. Excellent. With the S. Downtown. 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 So to, she. So she drives. He. So she. Re, sorry. Right. Drives. He's back to school. All right. So it says, so she drives to work, right? Correct. To work. Very good. Thank you. That's nice. Let's see, Veronica Alegría. Continue, please. You're going to go here. Like, no problem uh, with internet. Sushi. You have problems? Okay, Chris. All right, Christian. Hello. Hello. Let's continue here, please. And so she what? so she drives to Excellent. work. Nice. Our so our son is that person. Son our son Only doesn't one. excellent doesn't doesn't drive. Uh huh. He ride rides rides. Excellent. His bike to school to school. Very good. That's nice. Yes, okay. Miguel. Miguel Antonio. With number two. Yes. Yes. Let's do number My two, please. Parents uh -huh. My parents live. Live, because lives. it's plural. Live, live, live. live. Uh -huh. Good. Yes, yes. Perdón. You're welcome. Live. My parents live in the city. Uh -huh. My mother. My mother takes, takes a train okay. to work. Yes, very good. Thank you. Ibis, continue. My father. The audio, the audio, Ibis, please. Yes. Perdón, uh, my take... father is retired. 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 Uh, so, uh -huh. so, so he, he don't. Doesn't. Don't or doesn't? Is that person? Doesn't. 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 Work now. Now. Work. Yes, that's all right. Thank you, Fatima. He also. He also. Yeah. Uh, yes. Use. Third person. Third person. Uh, use. Uses. 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 Uh huh. Public, Public. transportation. Public transportation. So, so they, so they, so they, what's the call? So they, uh huh. That means car. That's they? a car. They is plural. So they uh, don't, don't, uh huh. Need a car. Don't need a car. That's correct. Good one. Okay. That would be with this exercise, right? Like sometimes we have a third person singular, he, she, or it. The rest of the subject, I, you, we, and they, we need to use base form of the verb. Or if you have negative or question, you need to use do, right, in that case. Or don't, if it's the negative. Let's see if we have another exercise by here. But this time about section two. This one was about house or apartment. We have an example here. It says that, look at the picture of Linda's apartment. Say what she has and doesn't have. There's a mirror in the bedroom. Remember here, there is or there are. Just that here is a contraction, there's. But there aren't any pictures in the bedroom. Can you give me another description, please? Veronica, Cepela, welcome. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. 
um, in the living room. Um, mm -hmm. There are okay television, but there are or uh, there is. There is uh -huh, because it's only one, right? Excellent. Only in one. the living room, there, there is, is a television. A uh -huh. television, but mm -hmm. there aren't. Uh -huh. um, a sofa. Or if it's only one, room. there is it. Ah, okay. Uh -huh, because it's only but one, right? You're saying one. Only one, but there, there aren't ah, okay. a living room. There aren't, you can say there aren't any sofas. Any, ah, okay. There uh -huh. are, entonces de, there aren't any sofas. Uh, very good, that's nice. There aren't any sofas, so there is one TV there is or there a is sofa. a TV, but there aren't any sofas. Okay. That's all right. You can give it like that. Thank you. It is. Give more description. Maybe the bedroom, maybe the, the kitchen area. In the kitchen area. Mm -hmm. There are uh, three chairs. Okay. There are three the, chairs. Three chairs. Uh, are um, one stove. Okay, there is one stove. There is one stove. Um, there is one table. There is one table. Do you see it, table? Uh, there is see. no table. Uh, no, 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 entonces no, no, mesa. no, sé lo que está la parte de la cocina. Let me see. No, there is not a table. Como it's like a cabinet. Uh -huh. It's a cabinet. Uh, this is, uh, it's a cabinet. Three. Or a thing. There is one curtain. Ah, okay. There is one curtain uh -huh. because there is a window, yes, right? I, uh -huh. it's the, there is... Um, también es... The... Ay, no sé cómo decirle que no tiene refrigerator. Ah, okay. Yeah. There isn't... A refrigerator. There, there isn't. Uh, uh -huh, that's good. There is an refrigerator. Uh -huh, that's mm -hmm. good. Yes. Okay. Y so that's. Uh -huh. There is. Um, quiero ver este. ¿Cómo se dice? Es pantry. Pantry. Uh -huh. One there pantry. Is, there is a pantry. There is a pantry. That's all right. Good one. Nice. Okay. Let's see. Luz. Are you present, Luz? Yes. Yes. Okay. Can you describe what you can see in the bedroom, please? A bed. Uh -huh. a there bed. is. There is a bed. There is a bed. There is a mirror. There is a mirror. What about the pillows? There are a pillow. Uh -huh. There are mm -hmm. how many? One, two, three, four. How many? Two pillows. Three pillows. Uh, maybe three, right? Uh -huh. There are three pillows. Oh, what three is in pillows. the back part? Uh -huh. There are three pillows. All right. Good. Nice description. That's to remember about. The existence. Uh -huh. The bed sheets. Right. Correct. There is one bed sheet. Yes. Nice. Okay, that's to remember about description of apartment or house. What about the workplaces? Like, what do you do? Let's check here. What do you do? Let's ask some questions there. Ibis, what do you do? Um, Say your occupation or profession. I am. Yes, I am a secretary. Very good job. Nice one. Marielos, what do you do? I am manager. A manager. Very good. Nice. Christian, what do you do? I am a technician. A technician? Uh, aircraft technician. An aircraft technician. Very good. Nice. Okay. Now let's select here. In a hospital, which professionals work in a hospital? We have doctor, nurse, who else? Secretary. A secretary? Uh -huh. Entra. Sorry? Surgeon entra también the in a hospital. Uh -huh. The surgeon? ¿Sí? Yes, that's another one, correct. 
Who else work in a hospital? Security. The security guard, correct. The mayor. The guard are in charge of the cleaning. Los encargados de limpieza. The mayor, the cleaning people. Okay. What about in an office? Who works in an office? Secretary. A secretary? Yes. In one boss? The boss, yes. A lawyer. Necessary, right? A lawyer, exactly. Who else? Engineer. Engineer, correct. Who else? Uh, maybe it's a secretary. A secretary, yes. Who else? Technicians? Do technicians work in an office? Yes. Yes, right. They're necessary. Actually, in an office, it's necessary to have like many professionals, different professionals, the technicians. Okay. I'm sorry? Uh, the limpieza. Uh -huh, the mayors. Uh -huh, that's true. Yeah, the janitors, right? It's possible that they do it. Correct. Very necessary. What about in a store? A cashier. Uh -huh. A cashier, a salesman, cashier. a salesperson, uh -huh. a salesman, a saleswoman. Who else? The guard. Ah, the security guard. That's true. The janitor, an encargado de limpieza, right? The janitor. Manager. The manager. Very necessary. Great. In a hotel? Mm. Receptionist. Receptionist. The receptionist. The waitress. Ah, yes, the waitress. Waitress. Yes. The janitors, um, the boss. The janitor, security. yes. Security, security guards, guards, very necessary. True. All yes. right. That is all right. Good. Okay, now let's go on. The next one. Section four. What about the mealtime habits? We talked about the different foods, the ones that you like to eat. But let's see about the frequency that you eat them. For example, if I ask, do you usually eat fruit salad for lunch? Juan Antonio? Do you usually do you usually eat fruit salad for lunch? Um uh, if, it's, if it's affirmative, you could say, yes, I usually, I usually do. You're uh, finishing the auxiliary, right? Fruit salad. Uh -huh. Fruit salad. Yes, I usually. Yeah, yes, yes, I usually do. Eat. Or exactly, yes, yes, I usually eat fruit salad. Fruit, fruit salad. salad. For lunch. Fruit salad. For lunch. For, for, for lunch. lunch. Uh -huh, that's correct. Roxana, are you present, Roxana? Ah, she's listening. She's listening right now. So let's see, Lening. Lening, can you participate, Lening? Gabriela? Gabriela, diga you? Hey, miss. Hi, Gabriela. Okay, let's see about the next one. We're going to check this one. What time do you usually eat breakfast? I usually eat breakfast at 9 o'clock in the morning. At 9 o'clock. Very good job. That's nice. Really good. Okay, now let's check with Carlos Arturo. Hello. Carlos, let's see with number four. Do you ever go to a restaurant for dinner? Mm, yes, I usually go to the restaurant for dinner. Excellent job. Really good. Nice. Ada. Hello, Ada. Hello, teacher. Hey, Sorry. Don't worry. Sorry. Can you listen very well right now? Uh, yes, yes, I yes. listen to the theme. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's check about number five. In this question, it says, what do you usually drink for lunch? Um, I usually drink, drink. To, I, I usually drink coca okay, for coke. my lunch. Coke? 
Coke. Coke. For lunch. For lunch. That's all right. Good one. Nice one. Thanks. Let's see. Edit. What is something you never eat for breakfast? Something you never eat for breakfast. Mm. Eh, puede ser, no sé, pollo, carne. Ah, eh, ok. I, so, I never, never eat. Never eat. Eh, I never eat. Meat. I never oh, eat okay. meat. Uh -huh. um, um, for? Chi for chicken. Oh, or chicken. Uh, ¿Cómo se dice? Evito mucho comer grasa. I avoid eating grease. Grease and in the bre breakfast. For breakfast. Uh -huh. este, usually, I usually fruit, fruit salad. Fruit salad. All right. I and usually yogurt. eat. And yogurt. Uh -huh. That's good. In cereal. And cereal. Very mm -hmm. healthy. That's true. <laughs> very healthy. Good one. Thank you. Okay, guys. Thank you very much. We had this short review. Now, remember that you continue on Monday. And congratulations that you finished this model. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you for your dedication. Tell me, tell me. Thank you. Muchas gracias por el tiempo dedicado, por su, por su paciencia. Gracias a todos no, también por you. participar. Gracias, de verdad, muchas thank gracias. Thank you. Thank you Muy so bonito much. como enseña, gracias. Ay, no, no, thank you. Estar con nosotros de nuevo. Teacher, eso le va a preguntar. Yes. Estar con se, nosotros. Se supone que sí, pero siempre vamos a esperar el mensaje de confirmación. Ok. okay. Pues, okay. Dígale que todos, por unanimidad, todas las queremos okay. a usted. I, I do, I do. I'm going to vote. Yo voy a votar también. I'm going to vote. <laughs> y empezaríamos el lunes. Esta, exactly. Es seguro que empecemos el lunes. Eh, vamos a esperar la confirmación porque nos han dicho okay. ahorita que sí. Vamos a Ay, empezar bueno. el lunes. Ajá. Teacher. Okay. We continue. Yes, tell me. Yo tuve un problema. Bueno, no sé. A mí no me mandaron ningún mensaje de confirmación de recibido mis documentos. ¿Y no ya les mandó mensaje a ellos directo? Sí, les mandé al correo no y les mandé al, al, que está, al que está encargado del grupo. que ahí, ahí cabal, Después que él manda mensaje, yo le escribo y nunca Ajá. me contesta. Oh, a mí igual. también yo, no me enviaron mensaje de confirmación, a me mí, envié todo. A mí sí, pero solo de los documentos me dijeron de que estaba mal porque estaba borroso, pero Ajá. volví a enviar y no me contestó. Sugiero oh, que le escriban okay. a Mauricio, creo que se llama mm. parte, para que yes. así le confirme. Ya le escribí, yo le escribí a los que yo me escribieron escribí a mí. Ajá. Oh, nothing, nothing. Y no me contesta. Mañana okay. bombardeemos. Me y ah, bombar, bombar. <ríe> igual, yo voy a, igual yo voy a preguntar. Yo voy a preguntar okay, igual a ellos directamente también. Muy bien. Okay. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Ada. Thank you so much. Ada, what happened, Ada? Um, solo quería decir que congratulations para Ivy. Yo siento que ha mejorado un montón. <laughs> yes. Sí, la verdad que yo hoy la, la escuché bastante fluida y bastante uh -huh. participativa y la verdad que le digo yo a, a, a Abby, le digo yo, ella ha mejorado bastante, le digo yo. Es por así, así que felicidades, siga así. Con, yeah, congratulations guys, everyone. Sí. It's your dedication. Es la dedicación que pone cada uno de ustedes. Es, es un esfuerzo grandísimo el que hacen porque todos pasan ocupados todo el día y en la noche conectarse, pero es un, es un esfuerzo, ¿verdad? Que pues todo sirve en esta vida. Así es, gracias. Yes, yes. Me, you can do it. Un gusto. Of course. Thank you very Bye. much, guys. Goodbye. Bye. I'll see you Thank Monday. Thank you Bye. for being work teacher. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Mm -hmm. Woohoo! Yes. Celebrate. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, guys. Thank you. Sweet dreams. Take care. Goodbye. <laughs>